Hey everyone, Kalevi here and welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're doing another spooky Halloween Squishmallow Squishmail unboxing. And this time, let's see if I can grab it in one hand, maybe. I have a huge box from Amazon, as well as a little package from Amazon. And then I have a package from Mercari. Oh my gosh, can't even hold it in the frame. I have a package from Mercari, which is the blue one as well to open up. One of them is not Halloween, so just a forewarning. Anyways, I hope you guys will enjoy because I'm super excited and I've had that blue package for so long that I don't even know who's in it, so it will be a surprise for me. And the two Halloween squish I got are really exciting, so anyways, let's hop right into our squish mail unboxing. Okay, you guys, so daylight is fleeting and so it's gonna get darker, but oh well. I am super excited. So again, we have the big Amazon one and it's not that big that it needs to be in this massive box. They just sent it in a massive box for whatever reason. And then we have a small Amazon package and we have the Mercari package, which again, I have no idea what's in here. Probably a cow knowing me. So let's get into it and I'm super excited. Okay, I'm going to start off with a smaller Amazon package, then do the Mercari and then do the big boy so we can work our way up to the massive one. So I'm really excited. I'm not sure which one this is. I ordered two Day of the Dead eight inches from Amazon and you know, like the new 2023 Day of the Dead ones. So I'm excited, not sure which one this is. Let's get into it. Actually, there's a little pull thing, let's do that. That's kind of fun and satisfying. Okay, guys, let's see. Oh shoot, some green on there. Ah, okay. So if you guys remember, actually in the first 2023 Halloween Squishmail unboxing video, I got Katrina in a five inch from Alan Goose, but then I saw she was available on Amazon and I talked about getting her as well. So here she is and she's so cute as an eight inch actually. Oh my gosh. Like the five inch is adorable, but eight inch is really good to collect, I think, because they're not too big. They're not too small. You know what I mean? And you can really see her details a lot better here. And she can match my other Day of the Dead 8 inches from last year, like the Day of the Dead Connor I have. So she is adorable. And yeah, she is so cute. And I can't decide if she's my favorite or if the Day of the Dead Ronnie from last year is my favorite. I have to say maybe Ronnie, but she is still very cute because I really like her dark sparkly horns. I think that's really cute. So that is our first one that we got from Amazon. And then now we have the two, right? So... Let's do the Mercari one because again, I have a lot of Squishmail packages I purchased like the last like five months and they're all piled together for so long. I don't even remember who's in it. I'm super excited. There's some white, so I'm thinking a cow most likely, but what cow? Still white. Okay, let's see who it is. Oh, I feel fuzziness. I remember who it is. Oh my gosh. Fuzzy 8 inch tan nose Connor. Now does he have a tag? He does not. I don't remember if he was supposed to have a tag or not. Oh, it's kind of sticky right here. Ooh, it's gross. That's not good. I didn't remember that. Anyways, I'm pretty sure I got this guy for a really good price and that's why he's kind of a little grody, but he is really cute. I do have the original 16 inch Fuzzy Connor, if you guys remember who released that Walgreens. Ew, I'm touching it. And now I have the new 16 inch Fuzzy Connor that is from Walmart, right? I got him a couple months ago. So now I have his other version, which is the similar version to the original 16 inch Fuzzy Connor, where it's just fuzzy on the spots. But this one is tan nose and everything. He looks so much cleaner and adorable. And I love him so much. I mean, isn't he so cute? Look at his tail. Uh, he is very gross though. I have to clean him. That's not expected. It's kind of disgusting. So I'll stop touching him, but he is very cute, so I'm very happy that I got him. I don't have his tag though, but it's the same as any Connor. So, so far we've gotten it. Ew, I'm touching it again. <laughs> we've gotten two eight inch cows. Actually, Connor looks slightly bigger. Hmm, interesting. Ew, I'm touching it, gross. Anyway, it's very, very cute. They're so adorable. Now we have the final Squishmail package. And as you can hear, it doesn't need to be in this massive box. They just did, I don't know. I am excited though. Let's get into it. So I ordered one of the mini Amazon 10 inches and I'm very excited. There's a couple that I wanted since they were added and slowly through the last month or so, I've been kind of ordering one like every week or whatever. So it's not like too crazy, you know what I mean? So anyways, I'm not sure which one this is. I have two big Amazon boxes, so I'm really excited. Let's see who it is. 
Okay, you guys. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Can you guys see who it is? Okay, so like they put all this bubble wrap, but like that's the size of the actual squish in the box. Like, are you kidding? Anyways, as you can see, yes, I got the 10 inch Geo. So I'm really excited. And this one was released on Amazon and he does have a tail. So the other two 2023 Geos, I've gotten the one from Five Below and then I got an eight inch also in Las Vegas, you guys will see. They don't have tails, but I'm so happy that the 10 inch has a tail. So cute, look at his tail, oh my gosh. Like, isn't he adorable? So this is the 10 inch, like I said, I pride myself on my Geo collection and I'm just now missing the 16 inch Canada exclusive geo from this year so i'm really excited i will do a separate short or maybe just a separate video in general showing my geo collection because it is crazy you guys and he is so cute i've been waiting to get this one for a while just because you know i already have him i was trying to get the newer ones first from amazon but he was the one i was waiting for the most and he's so cute i'm so happy that i waited because it kind of made him more special to me i don't know but he's so cute i love him so much and that is geo the 10 inch geo he has a really big forehead <laughs> poor guy but he's adorable i have to say it might be my least favorite geo though just because he looks a little derpy but he's still really really cute so you guys we got 10 inch geo and then we got 8 inch katrina these are both from amazon and then we got the gross but cheap 8 inch tan nodes fuzzy connor so cute so that is everyone that we got you guys and let's hop right into the review because i want to keep my squish mail video short so it's kind of like a contrast to my longer uh squish out videos anyways let's get into the review they're so cute okay you guys so here is our squish mail haul this is our second installment of like spooky squish mail this year and i'm pretty happy with everything i got even though this guy is very gross very gross i have to clean him anyways very adorable let's hop right into the review so we can keep this video short and concise but i am very happy with everyone that i got first off we got an eight inch of katrina you guys obviously would know that i got the five inch of her and i mentioned it earlier when i opened her but i think i prefer the eight inch let me grab the five inch of her so here is a comparison of the five inch and the eight inch and actually I don't know it's hard to choose i do think i like the five inch better actually but you can see the details a bit more on the eight inch and like i said i wanted an eight inch of katrina so it could go along with my eight inch day of the dead connor from last year i don't need to talk too much about her since you guys already heard the spiel when i first got the five inch in the last squishmail installment but look at her cute little fuzzy tail and i love the color green with the black combination she's so beautiful So that is the lovely 8-inch Katrina Day of the Dead Lawnhorn, and I love her so much. I just love the Lawnhorn cows. They're so cute. And let me know, do you prefer the 8-inch or the 5-inch version? Next, we got the gross but very cute 8-inch Fuzzy Connor. So he was released at Target like two years ago, and I was able to find everyone that year that I wanted at Target except for him. And kind of a bummer but i finally got him and i'm really happy to finally have him in my connor collection yes i would have preferred one that wasn't so dirty but if i can find the listing i'm pretty sure i got this guy for like ten dollars so i think shipped total it was like fourteen dollars really good price so i think he was definitely worth it even if he's a little grody there look at his little fuzzy tail i love him so much you guys now do you prefer the original Fuzzy Connor version like this? Or do you prefer the new Walmart version of Fuzzy Connor? I don't know. I do like this version, but I do like the Walmart version. Ew. Sorry. I touched it and it's like really gross because even this fabric is kind of gross to touch, but like it's like all gross. Yeah, I, I can't get into it anymore, but he's very gross, but I love him. And now I'm going to have to clean him because I don't want to touch him and put him near my other squish. And finally, our last squish that we got in the squish mail video today is 10 inch big forehead geo. And of course, he is a 2023 version. I mentioned this in my five below video, but the 2023 versions of geo are a lot darker. And let me show you a comparison. All right, so here is the 9.5 inch geo from last year. I could barely get them to stand up, but as you can see, they are a bit lighter. Well, this one's obvious to me, I guess, that he's a lot darker in color. So, I don't know. I don't know which one's my favorite. I think I still like the old style better, but I do like the new version as well. Also, I wanted to point out that this 9.5 version has the tail. 
Again, so does the 10 inch of this year. However, the Five Below Geo and this 8 inch 2023 Geo doesn't have a tail. So I'm not sure why, but that's how it is. Okay, enough about past Geos. Let's talk about this one. And again, I think he is my least favorite just because he has such a massive forehead. Like, what the heck? Why do I feel like he shouldn't look like that? I don't know, but um, he's still adorable. And like I said, I want every GL possible. I still think besides the 16 inch Canada exclusive Geo, I think I am still missing, like, I think they had an eight inch of him last year and I only have a 9.5 inch, I'm not sure. Anyways, I'm so excited to finally have another version and he's just so perfect. You guys know I love Geo, so like I had to get him and look how big and thick his tail is, okay. But he is adorable and I love him so much. So besides the fact that he has a massive forehead, I still think he's adorable and I was so happy to get him finally, since like I said, I was kind of letting myself wait on him to order. But I finally have him and let's get into his bio. So that is Geo, the 10 inch Geo, and that was our final squish for today's squish mail video. And he's definitely my favorite, but it's cause I'm biased. I love Geo so much. Okay, you guys, so that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed and let me know your favorite out of the three that I got. I would say Geo. I mean, I'm very biased. He's like my top three favorite squish ever. So obviously I would choose Geo, but who would you choose? Okay, you guys, so that was our squish mail for today's video. And I'm trying to do like maybe two squish hunt videos and then one squish mail in between. And that way it's kind of balanced. And let me know how you guys like it. And I will see you guys soon. Don't forget to leave a like and comment down below your favorite of the Amazon squish. They have a bunch of new ones, some Halloween, some even Christmas, and then some non-Christmas. I'll show you guys the green cow that they released just today, actually. And yeah, anyways, make sure to comment your favorite below and don't forget to subscribe because I still have definitely a bunch more Halloween squish mail videos to come. So yeah, if you guys want to see more, make sure to stay tuned and I'll see you guys in the next one. Happy spooky season.